Hello and welcome back to Shogun 2, the Satsuma Legendary Campaign. Where last time I left off, we had dealt with the army over here, belonging to the Miyazu. And uh, the Sasayama army is still heading home or heading towards Bingo. I'm not entirely sure what they're doing, but I am totally fine with them leaving my territory. Can I get you inside? I cannot, uh, but I probably will move them all the way anyway. I don't think this army is going to be able to chase him. You know, I don't really want to risk it either. Let's put them over in the forest here so that they don't spot him. Because they might be like, hey, there's a single unit right there. Let's go kill him. Uh, and then you are going to go straight in there. And they're just going to go down here. This army is still like, completely... It's not the army I'm going to use at all to advance. But it's, it needs to be good enough to defend. I think at this point when these guys got in here, I would have been okay with attacking them if I had to. But I still would have preferred not to. Um, you're going to go back into Izumo. How happy is Izumo? Izumo is happy enough. That we can move out. We are a little depleted still, but not very much so. And we want to press the attack because they probably haven't got a whole lot of stuff anymore. I'm gonna go down here actually. I don't even need to know what the, what these guys have got around here. This is this is the Sasayama that wants the army over here. Uh, I guess we'll just keep blowing them up unless there's stuff to do with this navy. I don't think there is. Kill this ship real quick. Or take it, even better. I haven't got that much money anymore, though, to be fair. Speaking of, let's take some more. Um, okay, so we're gonna move out. We're gonna have to keep this guy behind here. He needs to keep he needs to stay behind here anyways to convert this place over because it's still well it's 67. It's it's fairly high up now, but um So we want you and the army for sure. We want you and the army too. And her. It will be my, my pleasure. pleasure. Right, and we're gonna stay in our own territory so we can replenish for another turn. Okay. Uh, I also should just move this ship over here to go repair. That is very expensive. Uh, I probably have the money for that, but let's hold off for a second. Right, so you can attack, and you can reach. Let's go do that then. Oh. Good, that's a friendly ship. Alright, they stayed. Perfect. Take another one. Hell yeah. Pop them in there right away. And you guys are going to gather up together. And I'll probably go back, ho uh, go back home again so I can actually move over to stuff at some point. Uh, Alright, oh, the port's broken. We should repair that. The town is unhappy because of that too. But it wasn't mounting a rest unhappy yet. Shin 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 ranked up. So we shall level you up, my friend, to get that and that. Yeah. Uh, do you still need to be here? Because I really don't want him here anymore. Uh, I will take the extra point of assassination. No, I'll take that one. Right, how happy is this place? It's uh, going to be minus one if I were to move out. It's never going to become happy here either. God, we got a lot of provinces that are never going to become happy unless I get something like this, which I will get at some point. It's just I really don't want to spend money on an extra unit right now. But I do want this guy on the front line, especially if we're going to start advancing up here. We need to get more agents over. Uh, we have one here. Suo, four. Again, same problem. Same problem. This is never going to become happy. Um, sorry about the sudden racism that just got to me, though. Know. Current limit is free. We have five active. That's impressive. How do we manage that? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> that is impressive. Where are they? We got one there, like we know. We got, oh, right, that's the guy up here. He's the one I was thinking of that I couldn't find. That's still all going to go away, so it's going to be an extra plus three happiness. So we're always going to have to keep these two units here, or the guy. And then we'd have plus one happiness here. The guy. That's pretty shit. Um, are you guys... Yeah, you're in Neil Town, okay. I was gonna say, are they not hidden? That would be pretty bad. Anyway, we'll just repair that ship. Um, how many of these? We got five geishas as well, don't we? We have yeah, five out of the max five. We only have two out of the max two currently. Ninjas or shinobi. Shinobi. I think it might be time to start recruiting our army here, since we got some money. I can recruit two right now. 
I should also save up for this though, which we cannot quite afford next turn if I wait. No, we'll just be we'll be just short. Uh, yeah, you should wait here. We will be just short unless we don't repair that ship, which I think is the right call. This needs to be repaired as well, though. In fact, we need to get rid of this ship. So maybe I'll send this navy up there. Oh, we have a navy over here, but it's already done stuff. Yeah. Um. Okay, I've still got this gunboat, by the way. It's pretty funny. It's been there the entire campaign, essentially. It's been pretty helpful, to be fair. Not gonna lie. Unless, the, if as long as this keep you, uh, wow. As long as this army is staying here, we're not gonna need. Um. Yep, this place is happy anyway, actually. I can move him out without repercussions. I think. Buildings too. Oh, it's because these... Uh... No, it's because of the gambling then. Yes. Yeah, because this is the wrong building technically, but it's okay. I'll keep it for now. I'll probably get rid of it eventually, though. Um, yeah, you can come up this way. So you can go sit in... Where do I need you? I guess just up. Just up, up, up. We don't need him there. This place is actually happy. For realsies. Okay. Um, yeah, we'll save the money then. We're still not going to have that money next turn, but stopping the repair of that unit isn't going to, or that ship isn't going to do anything. I think it's worth getting rid of some units here actually to increase my income a little bit. Um, in fact, let's just get rid of all the shit ones. Just keep these guys. Are these the ones that are fully maxed out? 68. Yeah, they are. We'll keep them for now, but I'll get rid of them at some point as well. Actually, if I get rid of them, I'll definitely have the money next turn. But we actually need happiness here. In fact, we are unhappy with that arrangement. So let's recruit one more Imperial Infantry. <laughs> uh, yeah, I didn't realize. I thought it was, I thought I could get rid of four units, but I guess not. I miscalculated. Oh well, doesn't matter. So got these two units here as well, which is unhappy, but that's going to be fine again. Okay. Good stuff. Let's, uh, let's keep you with this army, shall we? Let's move it up a little bit. You guys are going to go in there. I don't even know how many units this army has. It looks like I've got two spots without having to fully count the thing, so perfect. That'll be a full stack then. A very odd full stack, but I'll completely take it. You have five of these, which means you have an uneven amount of them too. Yes, that's right. Okay, if that makes sense. Uh, it is wintered a couple turns. Three turns. We've got to take this before that. And I think we can go up to... No, we can't. Well, we... We can go up to Inaba. In fact, Hoki is already kind of dangerous. If we go up to Inaba, they can come down from down here and go just to Izumo or Hoki. The problem is, even if we take Hoki, if they come up from this way and go towards Izumo, we're kind of fucked. But we're still going to go take Hoki. We need to expand a little bit. Can't just sit back the entire game. I don't want to go too far, though, because we do want to wait for our actual good units to arrive. I'll, I might keep that first army the way it is for a long time. In fact, I might never replace it in its entirety. Um, but I will surely... How's our income so shit, by the way, still? Must must be getting blockaded elsewhere. Not us, but, like, the one of our allies getting blockaded. Um, like that one, although that didn't solve anything. Oof, that's a full stack right there, they don't want to lose that. Anyway, what was I saying? It's definitely something, I'm sure about that. Um... Yes, I might never replace this army, because it's actually, it's not terrible. It's obviously not what it could be. Unfortunately, as well, as every unit in there, um, every unit, one of these guys is upgraded, except for these two, which is kind of unfortunate. But anyway, I'll probably keep this army for a long time, and then maybe eventually I'll replace it or something. But for now, I will be keeping it, and I'll just replace this army casually, because this is just such a weird army. It's literally just there because I needed fucking stuff in case this army was going to attack me. Yes, Alright, you guys can get inside. Yes, I said get inside. There you go. Um, I'm a little worried about this. But uh, we're just going to have to deal with it. Right, can you... To solve the Emperor. Okay. First you bombard... Actually, no, let's wait, because they're going to run away. I assume they're running into the town, but let's just make sure. Nope, there you go. That's why. I want to make sure I'm still in range of them. Bombard them, and then we'll take the town. They come in with reinforced range, but they'll die as well. And the other was off, yeah. Good, good. 
Oh, that was a lot more painful than I expected it to be. I'm gonna need some rest after that. And there's our level up. Good, good. Anything down here? Not as far as we can tell. We shall repair that. So we got Courageous, plus two to the charge bonus of all units on this mask command, plus one to morale for the spans bodyguard. Okay. It's an interesting trait. Not terrible, not amazing. Not amazing! Get it? You are amazing. You are amazing! No? Okay. Uh, we want both of these things. Yes. And I think we want one of these, don't we? That one. Yes. Oh. That is such a crazy, like, bonus to the army all of a sudden. In fact, we should have a look at stats before we do that. Um, so these... Uh, let's take these guys. Um... Okay, what's going to differentiate the reload gun accuracy mostly? So let's just see, 40, 44 is 57. Was there anything else? It's as ammunition, right, it's really better. 44, 57. Armor, oh, armor as well. Uh, no, not that one. 44, 57. Oh, this is a plain plus 5. This is a reload skill now. Or percentage even. 44, 57. Wait, was it 57? Oh, was that one, right. Um... So 47, 62, so uh, the reload skill went up by 3, accuracy went up by 5, because that's a plain stat. So the 10% is only 3 reload skill, which isn't really all that good, actually, if you think about it. Which is also kind of weird, because 44, 10% of 44 is 4.4. But I'm guessing it doesn't take into consideration the experience level ups or something. The stuff you get from that, it probably takes the, the base stat, which is 30... No. Yes, because then we get yeah, we got plus three. So yeah, it just gives us extra plus three. Right. I need you to get in there and get repaired. Um If I save up for the building I can probably get it next turn, so I think I will. I was gonna build something there, but let's hold off. I do need to get rid of this ship. Is it a good ship? We don't know. Let's find out if it's a good ship or not. It is not uh, it is a good it's a very good ship, in fact. Now I can't get back into the port, so we might lose our ship, which is also a pretty good ship, but it's not a very good ship. Um, you can't get out of there, can you? No, you can't. Well, that was a darn shame. We just lost a ship. A pretty good ship. Let's just uh, forget about them. Repair this stuff and just not get the building next turn either. Um... I spend my money on something else as well then, or do I actually try and save up uh, like at some point, maybe? I think I try and save up at some point. Again, I could build a building here, but well, I can't only build a cottage industry, which is not, not something I want right now anyway. Okay. Oh right, I forgot this. Welcome. Be seated, and tell me all the concerns that bring you here. I only missed the turn of trade with them. It's not too bad. You must pay me some money, though, boy. Oh, they're just not willing to pay any money. All right. Uh, I want you to join all my wars. You should have. You should do anyway. Oh, there you go. Yeah, they will just do that. Maybe, I wonder if I shouldn't to let them build up a little bit more. I probably should just let them know. Can you introduce me to the Sioux? That'd be good. Yes, you can. Nice one. Thanks, mate. Be welcome, my friend. Be welcome. I ordered sake prepared to wet <laughs> our wits and warm our hearts. Be welcome, my friend. Morioka. Uh, I won't actually, because they're my immediate enemy, and I don't want them to somehow get distracted. They probably wouldn't, but let's not make any. Let's not get any. Uh, or take any chances, shall we? Look at the amount of fucking <laughs> shogunate clans compared to our imperial clans. This game is crazy. If the Tosa were still allied to us, it would have been a different story. But even then, there's like this entire side is is all fucking shogunate. This is all shogunate. The fucking Tosa Island or uh, Shikoku shogunate. So much shogunate. It is insane, you might say. Anyway, whatever. We got some more income from that. Oh, that actually will give us that building still next turn, so thank you very much. I will take that. Now, this place is still going down. We are, must be done with Neophyre next turn. Okay, so 
gonna say, must be done with Needlefire soon. Once we get that, we go for the plus one happiness across everywhere, and then it'll that'll solve a lot of stuff. It'll mean I can get rid of a lot of like shitty units across the board, um, which will save us quite a bit of money in the long run. I kind of forgot to move those agents, but it worked out all right. Uh, you, I don't know where you're going, but it's very dangerous to take one ship. Yeah, he didn't attack my navy. It didn't cost me anything either, because apparently that any trade that was going through that port was already being blockaded at the other, like, clans thingy jig. That didn't cost any- No! Why are you moving out, you idiots? There's an army literally about to attack your town. You guys are so stupid. This is what you keep doing. There you go, there's your town gone. And apparently that other army just walked past. Oh, they- yeah, they- well, they still have a town. Oh, shit, there's the Odavara. Oh, f why every fucking go isn't- oh, don't me. Uh, hey, that's good. Or is it? That's gonna give a lot of unhappiness right now. We don't want that. We need... Let's go for the plus one first, I guess. It doesn't give us anything else after. It's only seven turns now. <sighs> I saw this just now. It's very annoying. Um... We, it's, I, uh, I, we already have... I could use one more. No. Yes. Sure. I don't know what we're dealing with on the old loyalty front, but uh, we're okay. This guy's got like minus three, doesn't he? Yeah. That's pretty crazy. But he's still good enough. Okay, this is uh, problematic. We haven't got a navy around here. We've got these ships though, which I'll start sending up. So hopefully we can intercept them next turn. Which means we can't do anything about this, but I'd rather they blockade this port than land an army over there. Now, how much? How many towns are unhappy? A couple. We're going to counteract that minus one that we just got with uh, this, but it's going to take seven turns, so we have to recruit a couple units too. <laughs> That's all I think about that. The fact that they're incoming, by the way, is very possible that there will be more incoming as well. Nagato, of all places. Unfortunate. So yeah, they lost this. Is their army still here? There it is. Okay, so it didn't die yet, at least. They can take this as well, but what the fuck are they doing, man? What are all these armies doing? They're just walking past each other constantly. So they're on the way now, and I guess they're going to walk past Aki again. But if I have to, I will, be, I will be forced to attack it now, and I have an army to actually do so. It's still not a very good army, but it is an army. Um, I wouldn't mind killing her, but I'm not sure if I have, will have the chance to do so. Alright, why don't you guys get repaired? Uh, ninja. Keep checking out the rest of them. Okay, there's a small force here. Are they building the cannons over here or something? They're not. We're already building the cannons right there. Field artillery school. That explains it all. Alright, I think this might be enough to intercept them. It might actually work out quite nicely because they're. If they. Uh, uh, wow. <laughs> As long as they don't land it anywhere near it. Well, as long as they don't land it on this one, or that one, I guess that would actually be kind of bad for us as well. But that's owned by our ally now, so they probably wouldn't. Unless they don't, unless they land it here, I don't think they're going to be able to reach this one. I guess we could find that. Yeah, we can't reach that. So they'll end up over here somewhere. If we attack them, we should be able to reach them again afterwards. Unless we get our navy taken out. But the thing is, yeah, they, they're coming. That probably means there's more clans incoming as well. And that's really bad, because we just have nothing... To deal with any of that right now. Uh, Saga are gonna land an army hopefully effectively somewhere. We should build some more ships but we haven't really got the money to do that. <sighs> Is my accurate representation of what I am currently thinking. Fuck. That plus one isn't even gonna do it anymore. Maybe we should just skip it. Maybe we should go straight for that one. It takes three extra turns but we get plus two instead of plus one. Um, gives us some other, like, okay-ish useful stuff as well. We really just need plus two right now, because plus one isn't going to cut it anymore now. We'll still have the same issue as we had before, because we just lost one happiness from the clan development. Minus two, minus three. <gasps> so, yeah. That's, uh... Kind of annoying. So, you guys are going to have to stay here. We can't really go after Inaba, because it'll just leave us way too open for anyone to anyone else. You know what, I probably will just use this army to attack a little further up. 
once we've taken care of this army, if we can take care of this army. This is still a better army than us. I still don't want to attack it in the field, but at least I don't have a general in there. Nor in there, so that saves us some grief. Alright, hold on. I guess we'll use the money to assassinate this lady. That's good. If anything, it's experience. I mean, again, we can't use the money for that fucking building, but at this point I'm not even too bothered about it anymore. I really should start recruiting other units, though. I need to get Imperial Infantry. If I can just get Imperial Infantry up here, I'm not worried about anything anymore. I think it's just that I'm not really worried about anything. It's just I'm worried mainly about the fact that there are so many enemies. And if they start landing naval invasion after naval invasion, there's no fucking way we can keep them back. So I'm like, honestly, I'm worried about that. I'm not really worried about our army quality at the moment. It's not great. Oh, I should have moved them further up. It's not great. But it's like... We'll be okay, type thing. But if we get attacked in several locations, then we just don't have the men to deal with that. And that's the main problem. Oh, they're still sitting in EO? They haven't even moved out of there yet. I thought they were, like, conquering the world over there. The Saga need to land that army and be useful as well. Because I need them to be useful right now. What are you... Why? Why don't you just bombard someone else, man? What the fuck is wrong with you? Nice. Keep him off. Hiroshima. They've made some really odd choices so far, but at least they've conquered a, like some a part of Shikoku, which is good. Okay, they didn't move very far. They'll take about two turns to get to us if they decide to attack us, but I very much doubt it. We'll have to attack them in the field, I can only imagine. There's that. Okay, so yeah, they landed about where I thought they would, which is good for us. We should be able to take care of them. I sure hope we can. Winter... Uh, I'm gonna let that break some more. Leaves the town unhappy, so I should recruit a unit. Uh, Alright, she leveled up. That was the thing I was coming here for. Inspiring troops. Oh, that will cause the happiness to be fine too, actually. Uh, I should get that to save the other points. Or should I... Uh... Mm, yeah, we should just get this. Right. Escape following action, uh, unsuccessful actions, chance of escaping from enemy agents, or charm intending enemies. I'll take that one. Dunno. Right, so I don't actually have to recruit that unit anymore. It'll be fine regardless. It's just a matter of whether I want to or not. So maybe I do still, but for now we'll just hold off. Clan encounter the Odawara. Well, I already saw them last time, so thanks for the heads up, but. Got him. Right, now please don't flee too far. Flee into that little... Yes, perfect, that's where I wanted you to go. Alright, so that's the first naval invasion dealt with. <laughs> I fucking love how the AI sends them, like an entire... Well, not an entire army, but close to an entire army on a fucking shitty ship. May as well send a gunboat. Alright, that's one dealt with. Thank the lord for that. Thank the lord for that. You guys are repaired. I'm, I'm tempted to send a couple ships south, so I have more ships down there, but I think I should just recruit more ships is the main issue. Alright, I'm going to try and not spend enough money, or two. I'm, I'm going to uh, try and spend so little money that I can... Um, that I can actually afford that building next turn, because I just want to get it done so that I can recruit any unit I want here. The best ones. Um, and currently, I will have the money. Uh, Agents, yes, you guy. You, you, you guy. Um, I don't really need them in here either. Not for happiness, anyway. I kind of need them over here now for happiness, so I can get rid of a unit, which will save us some money. But I think I'll just send them up and start converting this place. Making my way downtown. We should move out a geisha and move him inside, but we'll do that next turn. Now, you keep following. Actually, check this out. They still haven't taken this place, so... Oh my god, they lost, didn't they? So this, my ally lost this fight, because obviously they, they attacked them, but they lost. Did they survive? They did, but they're taking attrition. They're not going to be able to beat them now, are they? It would be close, but I guess they it's just castle defense thing, so they've got a massive bonus. Yeah, they're not going to make that. So they are essentially gone here. They've still got this army here, which I'm sure is quite... Meh. Probably, actually. It's not very good at all. I was going to say it's probably quite good, but it really isn't, I, I assume. It's more so that they still own something, and it's going to be difficult for them to lose this. 
I can only imagine, but still. It means I have to deal with at least an army and a half here, plus whatever else they decide to throw at me. And they actually have better units than me, so still kind of afraid. As much as I don't want to spend money, I'm tempted to recruit a unit or two just so I have like a... Even if I have like 22 units or something, you know, I just want, I need to get a bit of an edge. I could recruit good units, but if I do that, then I definitely won't have the money next time. And that's kind of the issue I've got. I really need Cav in here, but I can't get Cav in here. Uh, yes. I wonder if these guys would be in reinforcement range of the town. They won't attack the town, that's the thing. If they run past, they run over here, we can get these guys in range. It's not a great navy, but it would help. That might be our solution there. Now, can I recruit this unit to have muff enough money next time? No, I cannot, so let's not do that. Okay. Um, well, that else, that's going to have to do then. Let's uh, end the turn. Not sure why I keep looking at diplomacy. Although, to be fair, there has been diplomacy, some diplomacy done lately. So, Damn it, they're sending them all the way east. I need, I need them to land on, on Ch Shikoku Island. If they can take Shikoku Island together with those guys right there, that would be so good for me. But if they... Oh, nice. The Sioux are fucking on a roll. Oh, actually, no, they're losing territory. But they were doing quite well. If they can take it together, then I don't have to worry about taking that place myself, and that would be so good, because then they, I won't have to worry about naval invasions, having to protect against naval invasions in, like, all those lo different locations. I already have a small island. Yes, walk into my attrition, good man. If I have to defend that island, as well as Shikoku Island, as well as um, Kyushu Island, and the mainland from naval invasions, it's just not going to fucking happen, is it? There's too much shit to defend against. But we're gonna have to just fucking make it. Oh my god, have we got enough money? Yes, we have 20 more than we need. Thank the Lord. Okay, uh, that's good. I mean, it's not it's not even that ba ba big a deal if we can't recruit it yet or build it yet this turn. It's just you know I kind of want to at this point. All right, so they are taking attrition, which makes it actually oh, they're gonna go for this thing or the port. Either one, they're gonna they're gonna attack something. It looks like this one though. Um. The longer they spend here attacking these things, the more men they're going to lose, so I am completely fine with them doing that, actually. But I will be ending the episode here, so thank you very much for watching, hope you enjoyed. Next time, more of the same. It's, uh, it's, this is one of those campaigns that's just constantly on a thread. Like, we're looking quite safe, but a naval invasion over here, for example, will just completely fuck us, and there's nothing we can do about it. Um that type deal so we are looking okay but if something bad happens we are fucked immediately so and there's just no way we can prepare for all of that because we gotta defend the front lines and we don't have a force here yet nor can we re really rec uh, recruit one yet but anyway next time until then have a good day and goodbye